Hello. Can we hear me? Yeah. Okay. So, um, like I said, like he said, I'm not in my usual costume, but I should have known I would be performing today because I wore my lucky socks. Um, <laughs> stuff happens when I wear my lucky socks. A little bit lower. There we go. Now, um, by a show of hands, I might be able to see you. How many of you have seen, besides me, a sword swallower perform? A few. Cool. Um, is there anyone in this room who thinks that sword swallowing is a trick? It's okay to speak up. Come on, be honest. If there are any hands that I'm not seeing spotlights, help me out. Come on, stick your hands in here. Be honest. Be honest. Well, regard. Well, no skeptics in the room. Cool. So, um, do you want to come inspect my swords? It's not a euphemism. <laughs> Round of applause. Give me my hands. What is, uh, what is your name? Mike. Mike. I'm Frankie. It's nice to meet you. Big round of applause for Mike. <laughs> now, first things first, do you have a latex allergy because there's something I want you to put on? <laughs> <laughs> is that a no? Okay. <laughs> yeah. So I know, you know, I've heard that when people share a stage together that, you know, can be a really bonding experience, and you seem really cool and everything, but I don't want your germs in my stomach. So if you just wear those, I will let you inspect my swords. Again, not a euphemism. Oh, come on. Don't worry, there will be euphemisms. <laughs> okay, all right, now that you've got these on, I'm gonna hand you my small one first, not that size matters. See, I told you. Um, now, tell me, does it, go ahead, take all, is there a button somewhere, does it retract? No, is it plastic, does it bend? Is, does it, is it, I mean, is it steel? Steel. Okay, cool, it even says made in China, stainless steel, right? Okay, all right, now, that's my small one. The same thing with this one. Now this one uh, actually goes to the bottom of my stomach, and I'll explain that in a minute. Now is there a button on that? Yes, there's some, there's some magical stuff called mouthwash on it because it makes it taste better on the way up. Um, so yeah, these are, these are the real deal, yeah? Cool. Um, I'm going to have you do one more thing before you, uh, before you go sit back down. Now, I myself am kind of a skeptic, but I have a little tradition. Um, in, in the nature of what I do, I kind of like to tempt fate a little bit, so we all know what this is, yeah? It's a magic eight ball. Yay. Yeah. Yeah. Ah. Oh, yes, very good. You're, tra you're training them very well. Um, so, every time I, I perform sword swallowing, I, I have a victim, a volunteer, um, uh, come up here, yes, <laughs> don't worry, soon I won't be able to talk because I'll have my mouth full. Um, <laughs> and uh, ask this snarky magic eight ball whether or not I'm going to get hurt during this next performance. So, it doesn't always tell me what I like to hear, but um, I don't care because it's not the boss of me. Um, now, so take that and ask, is Frankie going to get hurt during this next performance? Is Frankie going to get hurt this next performance? Now, you have to shake it up. You know the drill, right? Uh, wow, okay. Now, what does it say? Can you see it? it happens to all of us at Yeah, a it's all right. You can hold it out here. Very okay. doubtful. Very doubtful. Oh, well, you know what? I'll, I'll live with that. I can live with that, I think. Let's, let's find out. All right, thank you so much. Big round of applause. You keep those gloves. Souvenir. All right, now, how many of you, by a show of hand, know how sword swallowing works? Hmm? I was just thinking uh, that. Well, I can, I can see some silhouettes. That's your inner voice, right? Yes. Wow. So, I'll show you. 
Now, I'm going to start with the small one first because, let's face it, we all need a warm-up. But <laughs> the way this works is this sword is going to enter through my mouth, unless I'm having a really stupid day, and it's going to go uh, you know, down my esophagus, past, yes, thank you, it's a demonstration. Um, it's going to go past my voice box, not into the pharynx, but past, it's very important and further down into my chest, traveling in between my lungs. What? Mm -hmm. And right about here-ish, it's gonna nudge my heart slightly to the left, my left, not your left, very important difference. And then it's going to travel further down, passing by my liver and all sorts of other vital organs. And it's going to enter through my stomach, finding its resting spot inside my stomach. Where did that come from? <laughs> <laughs> Do I, did I just conjure spooky music? <laughs> God, is that you? Yeah. Um, Don't kill her, we need her for the show! <laughs> yeah, no, you re really. We'll think about it. Okay, so, for those of you who are squeamish, I know there are some of you in this room, this is the real deal, so look away if you're, don't faint, because I don't want to clean up after you, and you know, I, we don't want you to faint anyway, okay? So I'll do my, uh, I'll do my really slow motion uh, example for, first with this one, okay? Are you, are you ready? Do you, yeah. give it, yeah, okay. Can I, can I get a drum roll and a, and a countdown from three? Three, two, one. Now that was the small one. The next one actually does hit the bottom of my stomach. And uh, what I'm gonna do is something obnoxiously, like I'm, I'm totally gonna promote the crap out of what we're doing right now, because isn't this awesome? Yeah. yeah. Um, selfies annoy the crap out of me, so I like to take them on stage, ironically. Um, I take sword swallowing selfies, and for short I call them swelfies. Um, so this is going to be the one spot in this show where I'm going to encourage you to take a picture. If you want to get your phones out, that's cool. But then put them away immediately after and then post like on Facebook or Twitter or whatever. Hashtag open stage, hashtag circus freaks. So I'm going to get all of you, I'm going to turn around, I'm going to get all of you in the picture. So if you don't want to be in it, then... Hide under a table. Yeah, something like that. Um, all right, let me get this ready. One must moisturize, so. Uh. <laughs> Not a euphemism. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. See, this one goes a lot further down. Can I get a number, another drum roll, please? Get ready to swelfy! There is no filter for this on Instagram. Thank you so much. Now, if you enjoyed any of what you're seeing tonight, and you're, I know we have some new faces in the room tonight, Please, we, we do this sort of stuff all the time, and we're doing another show. He mentioned Salma Gundi. While it is family friendly, even I get to be in there. So, I mean, it's, we've got a little bit of something for everybody. I might make less euphemistic jokes in that room, but come see us. We're going to do it next time on June 19th, and uh, just find us, follow us. We do all sorts of cool stuff. So, yeah, thank you so much. Frankie Stiletto.